Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercard, episode 125. It was a race, but we actually managed to get there actually in decent-ish time. Uh, I thought it was going to be a bit closer. I, at one point, I really didn't know if we were going to get it or not, but we are going to get it with uh, two hours to spare. At one point, it really didn't look like we were going to get it. We were on Elite Eric Rowan seven or six hours bef it, you know, before it ended. It didn't look good. It really didn't look good. But we managed to pull through, and we're only 50 points away from getting this card. So I'm going to play a couple games. I'm going to show you guys my hardened uh, fusion, and I'll give you guys a quick look at my King of the Ring. So, uh, yeah, let's get into a game, and I'll show you how many points I'm on in a bit. If you guys have seen my stream, I've just been streaming on Twitch for the last hour and a half. It was, it was, it was close, but uh, I'm happy to say that a lot of people in the team have put shift in. We will be kicking maybe one, maybe two members in the team over the next couple of days. So if you guys do or are in WrestleMania 33 tier and want a spot in the team, uh, I'll be letting you guys know when there is a spot free on the next couple of videos in the next couple of days. Speed will go with Shawn Michaels there. That's a win. And we need to. I need. To, I want to talk to you guys about Raw a little bit. It was. It was a decent episode of Raw. Um, yeah, it was good. It was actually quite good. Last couple of episodes of Raw have been okay, better than before. Um, before WrestleMania, so they've been okay. Definitely been okay. Not. I don't think I'm better than SmackDown, but okay. And the spot. The main spot I want to talk to you guys about was uh, the main event. Uh, well, we had Jeff Hardy Cesaro, which I thought was a good match. Um, fun to watch. It was good. Uh, a good a good fail four way match with the women's championship for the number one contender match. Um, that was actually I liked it. I really liked it. I thought Alexa Bliss was great in it, um, and she got the win. Very happy with that. Um, had had some good matches as well. Other other, other good matches on the card. Um, and so Mori in the club. That was actually a decent match. We've seen it a lot, but it was a good match. And then the main match, the main event. Oh, well, sorry, we had Samoa Joe and Chris Jericho as well, which again solid solid match. Um, uh, Jericho putting Joe over clean as well, which is good. It's making Joe Berg uh, be built up as a bit of a beast before he goes into his match with Seth Rollins at Payback. But anyway, the main event, it was Big Show versus Braun Strowman. Uh, Braun Strowman went a bit wild in the card, beating up R-Truth, beating up Gold Dust, beating up Kalisto. Braun Strowman came in and was like, pick on someone your own size. That was good. Really enjoyed all those spots. The ring collapsing in the main event was... Really fun to see, good spot, the ref took a bigger bump than the wrestlers, whoops, so that someone just followed me on Twitch, I forgot the name, so no shout out, sorry, um, but yeah, no, it was a good spot, the ring collapsing, we've seen it a couple of times before in the past, but it's actually a good moment, They had, as long as they don't really overdo it now and keep it off screen for a little, for a good while, it was good, it was exciting to see something different, it was good close to the show, uh, Roman wasn't on it because his brother passed away apparently, I saw someone say that in the stream, it's not, I have no... I'm no confirmation of that. I haven't seen anything of it, but if it is true, uh, rest in peace. And my prayers, prayers go out to Roman and his family for the next 24 hours. And then I'm going straight back to hating Roman Reigns. But my prayers will stay on with the family. Whatever. Um, but yeah, overall it was a good show. Uh, let's see how SmackDown does tonight. Hopefully the SmackDown's good as well. Hopefully better. Uh, we'll see Kevin Owens on it, which will be really exciting. So yeah, looking forward to it. All right, this game is over. I think just about, yeah, there we go. And there we go, well, that's, that's actually the last game on it. That's fantastic. We've gotten Samoa Joe, and we're done. We are done. Fantastic, really happy with that. Was worried we weren't gonna, but it looked, it, we, actually, we actually did well. We really did well. Uh, members in the team really showed up when they needed to and, and got the point. So Samoa Joe is now another WrestleMania single for me. And I'm gonna quickly type in the chat. Good job, guys. Proud of yeah. <laughs> there we go. Um, and let's quickly lock in that Brock Lesnar. Oh, I didn't show you guys the points. There we go. I'm no, oh, I finished. No, I finished second. Oh dear. Anyway, I finished second, but pretty yeah. Franklin. Good job, good job to everyone. There we go, as you guys can see. 710, 700, 500, 425, 425, 420, 450, 280, 215, 190. Yeah. Thank you to everyone who played a lot and really grinded their ass off, and a couple people who didn't. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. This is my King Ring. This is how I'm doing in it. 
Um, well, that's not standings. I'm 12 and 8, which is okay, not good. I am currently joint fifth with World Stobis. You guys don't know him, awesome guy. And a couple of other people, um, 18 and 2. Scared, scared, scared about that. But we got, we got, we got the cards, the good, a good enough deck to hopefully make it far in this King Ring. So I think, I think we can do well. I think we can do well. I'm gonna quickly energize actually for this next game because it might be a bit close. Got a lot of energy cards, so we'll be okay. We will be okay. So I have Sam buying my Diva tag as you guys saw in the last episode, but yeah. And anyway, hard infusion. Let's see who we get. Um, who are we? Who do we want? I think we want Alicia Fox, really. So uh, yeah, three, two, one. Who do we get? Give me Alicia Fox. Is that Akam for the third time? That's it. No, that's Razor, the other guy from Authors of Pain. Never mind. Um, let's get straight into an elite fusion. Not gonna wait and a second longer. We need to go unlock some. Some support cards. Let's go and quickly do that. One of these should be good enough. Oh, I don't know if it is. I don't know if it will be. I actually don't really know. But I'll find out. I will find out. Come on. Waiting on the network. Okay, so I've been able to play on blue stacks quite well. Not too many waiting on the networks. On my on my phone, it has just been the, the biggest pain in the arse ever. It, it seems like it kicks me off every two minutes. I don't know. Can't. I don't know. I don't know what is going on. That's 15,000 points, so we're going to need a little bit more than that, actually. I might have slightly underestimated how many we needed. Um, and I don't think we've got any ultimates that are pre-unlocked. Uh, I don't think so, I don't think so. Let me quickly have a quick little check. Oh, if that Nakam, hopefully that Ken Shamrock is. No, that I locked that Ken Shamrock, damn it. No, I'm not putting that Samoa Joe in there. No way. So it doesn't matter. All we need to do is just go ahead on com not combinable enhancements. Unlock another. Rest my new one. Fusion chamber. Go all the way back up to elite. Put in razor. And then put in our enhancements. One and two. We are over it by not too much, it's not a big overkill, and we're going to go and activate that, and I will see that in five days. Perfect. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. This is just quickly my current uh, contracts in Money in the Bank, as soon as the waiting on the network's over. If you guys have enjoyed this episode, do drop it a like, that'd be appreciated. I'll see you in the next one, until then, take care, and peace out.